The next method we want to show you is making an impression smear. An impression smear can be made from any biopsy or from surgically excised tissue. Here I have a piece of liver tissue. So the first step we're going to do is to create a fresh cut on this tissue. So I will take a scalpel blade and cut this tissue in about half. Then the next step is to take that fresh cut tissue and you want to blot that fresh edge on a paper towel. And the purpose of that is to try to eliminate the excess blood or fluid, which will cause contamination of your sample and then you may end up with only blood cells on your smear. Then we will take a slide and gently touch that same fresh edge to the slide. And I have room to make about three impression smears on that slide. You can keep making uh, two or three slides, so I'll make two in this case, gently touching the tissue each time to that slide. Then these slides can be air dried and labeled with a pencil, labeling with the patient information and the site, packaged into a slide protector and submitted to a diagnostic laboratory.